hello friends today we are going to talk about the intuitionistic fuzzy set right already we see that the fuzzy set right what is the fuzzy set let consider the universe as a capital x and we define the element small x now we see that what is the appearance of x in the universal set capital x how much strong the appearance of x in the universal set right now consider the appearance the appearance is full present then we give the membership value is one if the appearance is not that is absent totally absent then we give the membership value is zero furthermore like these cases these two cases the membership values is depends on the point of viewer here the middle of the two cases the appearance is fully present or non-existent or both so we give the membership value 0.8 or 0.7 something or 0.4 and 0.5 something whatever it may be and these values are called the membership values of x mu a of x okay so the first set is the ordered pair of x and mu a of x right now intuitionistic fuzzy set it is also like a fuzzy set since the fuzzy set have the membership function but does not have the non-membership function but the intuitionistic fuzzy set tells about that membership function as well as the non-membership function for the appearance and non-appearance of the element respectively so consider the non-appearance of the element in the universal set here we nothing to say that the non-appearance because totally full present so the membership value of the non-appearance is zero and the next one the non-appearance is exists so totally absent so the membership value of the non-appearance in this case is one also furthermore like these cases we give the membership value for the non-appearance of the element depends on the point of viewer right so i give the membership value for the non-appearance of these two is 0.2 and 0.65 something and these values are called the non-membership values of x right so which is represent which is denoted by new a of x new n u new a of x right so the intuitionistic fuzzy set is also called the order triple what is that x comma mu a of x and new a of x x comma the membership value of x and the non-membership value of x right now we clearly that the fuzzy graph or the fuzzy z have the membership values which represents only the degree of existence or appearance or occurrence but not the degree of non-existence or non-appearance or non-occurrence only the fuzzy set tells about the degree of appearance for the element degree of appearance or de degree of existence for the elements but in 1983 i don't know so introduced the new type of fuzzy set it's called the intuitionistic fuzzy set it is considered the both the parameters membership functions as well as the non-membership function of the elements of the set so an intrinsic fuzzy set which is also called the ifs so the ifs a defined on the universal set capital x is characterized as follows a can be written as the form of order triple which is x comma mu a of x and new a of x a new new a of x such that x belongs to capital x where the membership function new a mu sorry mu a from x to 0 comma 1 and the non-membership function new a from x to 0 comma 1 which can which functions which which are satisfy the following condition that is the membership values and the non-membership the sum of the membership and the non-membership values must be between 0 and non for all x belongs to capital x so this is an ifs into strict fuzzy right further one more function we have which is pi a of x what is that which means hesitation origin of x right hesitation means reluctance over two minded then the appearance of an element in the universal set of this case is present or absent as well as both present and absent because uh, we cannot judge the appearance of the element in this case so the appearance of an element is simultaneously present or absent as well as both of it right so which is called a hesitation margin of x pi a of x is equal to 1 minus mu a of x minus nu a of x also pi a of x from x to 0 comma 1 as well as the range between 0 and 1 right so now we consider the sum example to clear understanding let us consider the set of people in age group between age group 18 years and above this is my universal set capital x right if we denote the young people in age group between 18 to 40 years 18 to 40 years okay this is my membership degree we define the membership degree right and we can denote the old people in age group 50 years and above 
this is my non membership degree we define the non membership degree right so both of these cases eight we define 18 to 14 years by membership degree 50 years and above by non membership degree right but we does not say the 40 to 50 years people's right this category 40 to 50 years may be considered as young or old or both young or old so this is called the hesitation 40 to 50 years people may be considered young or old or both young or old so thus we can represent these people by hesitation degree right so that is two minded 40 to 50 years may be considered young or old or both young or old that is the hesitation degree now we take the random element in the universal set x right if we take the element is 18 to 14 years and we label the element as young people and we define the membership degree of that element right and if we take the element is 15 years and above and we label the element as old people and we define the non membership degree and if the element is 40 to 15 years and we give the label young or old or both and we give the membership degree of hesitation right so this is an example of intuitionistic physics at ifs next video we will talk about the intuitionistic physics graph based on this concept right thank you for all